This man walks his talk. This is Dr. David Gruder. And let me tell you, we were talking off camera and I was telling him what a special person he is. And he says, look, I know it took me some time to get here, integrity. So today he asked me how to dress because he's in shorts. And he mentioned, because I'm just going to bring a jacket. So we'll, we'll do a tight shot. And I said, but Okay, well, we normally just do the tight shot, but I have to reveal this because let me tell you, check out these sexy legs. You betcha. <laughs> hey, Doc. Look at. Uh, thank you so much for for doing that. That was incredible. Oh, mm, come my on. pleasure. I, you know, if I can't be playful and professional <laughs> at the same time, then something's wrong. <laughs> See, that's integrity when you can reveal the true story, right? <laughs> So tell me about your affiliation with CEO Space because you're an integrity expert, which I don't think I've ever met anybody who claims to be the integrity expert and actually does that and teach other people how to how to incorporate that into their business. Well, it's true. I may, in fact, be the world's only yeah. clinical and organizational psychologist whose primary specialization is integrity development and integrity management. So it's a very peculiar thing because there should be a lot of experts in this area. but People tell me they're, I'm the only one that they've ever heard of. And in CEO space, what Bernie Dorman, the founder and chairman of CEO space, has done is uh, activated me as the purpose partner for upgrading the integrity mechanisms in the CEO space culture, all the way from him at the very top of the organization through the faculty and the club presidents and the members so every level of the organization, and we're bringing organizational alignment around integrity in service of cooperation and collaboration that's going to revolutionize how business is done and make business a healthy, socially responsible, and profitable process. I think most people who, who took business or any sort of business uh, program, there was you know, a course called Business Ethics, and I think it was like one semester as well we were taught. How, how does this, what's the difference, or if there's a difference in that? Right. Ethics is about a specific code of behaviors, uh, things that are appropriate and inappropriate to do. And integrity certainly, of course, encompasses ethics. On top of that, however, there are mechanisms that upgrade integrity at a level that makes integrity profitable in business, uh -huh. that businesses don't know how to incorporate because they haven't been exposed to those. For most of us, most of us, we value integrity as, a, as a, an ethic, a value, an intention. Very few people say, I don't believe in the importance of integrity or it's one of its mechanisms, which is accountability. People say accountability is important, integrity is important. But when I'm brought in, it's to show people how to turn those worthy goals into action-oriented strategies that embody integrity. And it's that piece that is the different part. It's not about beseeching people to have more integrity or have better ethics. It's about actually showing people the mechanics of integrity that build collaboration and that build profitability and that build customer loyalty, employee loyalty, and decrease the kind of pilfering and fraud that goes on in business and any other organization. Mm -hmm. So integrity is a set of mechanisms and integrity management is a strategy for installing and upgrading the mechanisms that make integrity shift from a philosophy to a set of actions.